Transmission can be removed easily without splitting the upper and lower crankcases. The transmission case can be split with a flat screwdriver, then removed. When the transmission case cover is removed, the transmission, shift cam, and shift forks are all removed together. Then you remove shift forks, shift drum, drive gear, and driven gear from the case cover. After servicing, they are assembled in the reverse order. Upper and lower split type crankcases are used on the RD500 to improve ease in servicing. Tightening bolts with larger numbers are loosened first in two stages, beginning from 18 and going down to 17, etc. At first, loosen each bolt one half of a turn at a time, diagonally. When you are installing, you must torque bolts with smaller numbers first in the reverse order of disassembly. The upper crankshaft and the lower crankshaft are not identical. They must be correctly located. The section where the flywheel magnet is installed is on the left side of the lower crankcase. The primary drive gear side of each crankshaft should be on the right hand side of the lower crankcase. There are a number of points you must remember when you are installing them. The half circ clip should be installed like this, between the upper and lower crankcases. The knock pin of the bearing must be aligned to the knock pin groove of the lower case. The projected portion of the oil seal must be aligned to the groove of the crankcase. This is the end of the major points regarding disassembly and reassembly. For more details, please refer to the service manual.